நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா book of genesis chapter 18 verse 24 What if there are 50 righteous people in the city will you really sweep it away and not spare the place for the sake of the 50 righteous people in it Abraham stood before the Lord amen Abraham once gathered all 380 people from his house and went to defend Lot and his family by sword now instead of a sword Abraham is interceding to God in prayer for Lot and his town Once Abraham defended and protected the Lord and his people through his strength but now Abraham took a much mighty sword than the only one he trusted in prayer hallelujah in 2 Corinthians Paul wrote the weapons we fight with are not the weapons of the world on the contrary they have divine power to demolish strong hosts Abraham sought after this powerful weapon Even in those days Abraham knew well about both these weapons weapons of the world and weapons of the spiritual realm Lord is talking to you you may have fought your battles with your sword and strength you may have fought it according to your flesh you may have schemed based on your strength and faith you may have trusted your knowledge talents earnings job and status to fight the problems and lost them to the people of God I want to encourage you all to put down the weapon of this world and take the most powerful weapon of all time the prayer you may have tried everything and failed but those who take this specific weapon called prayer will never fail they will never lose prayer brings victory your prayers will be heard god will hear all your prayers and demolish every evil that rises against you he will blast the devil's fort it will become a flat land before you god will give you victory he will never forsake us hallelujah hallelujah god bless you